like I said it was really blue skies earlier I'm still exploring um, obviously the Holford Glen is down the other side of this hill here I'm approaching um, what should be another type of wood uh, close to Old Fox and House that is my plan and I shouldn't really have to go uphill anymore so if it's a bit shaky I apologize Beautiful this heather though, isn't it? It's a pity it was misty because we would have been able to see Well I can just make out Burnham on Sea and Brent Knoll with a naked eye um, I can just about see Hinkley Point and of course the sea's out there but it's very misty further over so you can't like see Steep Home or anything like that yeah we know we're getting there we're getting further down we if you see parallel to where I'm walking now is the valley from up there we came down from up there and walked down and we walked I walked up there this morning and what I'm doing now is I'm walking on the hill above the valley and there's, there is another path down that way, I know there is, because it comes out the other side of Old Fox and House, um, prior to the wood, prior to going up that, that route. I want to come this side of Old Fox and House, so that's why I haven't gone for that route there. Just down there, there, is a, there will be a path. Cool, you can, do you know, I can smell all those fragrances. Absolute heaven, right? But they don't give me hay fever. Do you know what I mean? I haven't taken the hay fever pill today at all. Because I know once I get out of Western and the smog, this won't help. All this smog over here in Western will be suffocating people. I mean, it doesn't help me. I can't breathe properly. And if they start putting the yellow pollution out from wells, then you know it really it really does affect your breathing I've said it before the moment I get out or up in the woods at Western I that feeling of suffocation um, goes within about half an hour yes you know when I was with Georgia before we decided to turn off we were kept we kept going up and up because we actually saw the trick point and I said to her one day we'll go up there Georgia I didn't feel like it then because we'd been walking all over those hills <sighs> I am enjoying it like I said um like I said I've been a little bit um edgy because of the moment they mention thunder it's like really with cows I'm similar but I haven't mentioned if you notice I haven't mentioned cows today because there ain't any up here now look at this the difference here you've got all this gorse and heather right look at it loads of it look come across here look at that gorse and grass but no heather. Now why doesn't the heather come up over this side? That purple heather. See that's an e interesting ecological phenomenon isn't it? I've walked miles, I've walked all over those hills. Miles and miles I've walked, but I love it. I'd be out every day over here. If I, I don't live that far away. 
But the thing is, um, the bend dips are closer to me because I, I live in Western. But um, no, if I did move to say the Bridgewater area, um, I would definitely be up here. <sighs> And you have got to keep your dogs on leads, by the way, because although there's no cows as such, I think there might be now and again, there are sheep, and the sheep are everywhere, and they're tucked in and out the heather. So you don't always see them exactly. Um, they don't come out to greet you. They're, um, they're just darted about everywhere, the sheep are. <sighs> Look at that. What a scene, we'll be leaving this in a minute because we'll be going down. What a beautiful scene. I'm surrounded by gnats, by the way. What a beautiful scene this is, eh? <sighs> Absolute beauty in it. And I'll be, like I said, I'll be leaving it <sighs> for now, in a minute. We're going back out. It's like I said, it's a pity it's uh, hazy because it would be absolutely gorgeous if the sea was there. If, we, if, if the sea was visible, it would be absolutely gorgeous. Now we're going down very quickly. We might come out. I've got a feeling actually that it, it, we needed to be over there with that wood there to come out by the house so we might actually come out somewhere completely different in fact that track that those people were on would probably did take you into the wood there and down which is where I wanted to go actually we'll see we'll see what happens when we get down the bottom here there might be a, a path yeah I, I reckon we come that is the wood that's my, th or it could be that one. <laughs> oh, I'll find out in a minute. Right, over and out. <sighs> over and out. <sighs>